Hi everyone, welcome to Java Express Academy. Guys, uh, till now we discussed two concepts, where keyword and optional API changes. Now this is another topic called immutable collections. Okay, so have a look here. What is the importance of immutable collections? Basically, why we need these collections? Immutable collections, immutable means we cannot modify when after its creation. Okay, so once you create any object with some elements after creation, if you are trying to, you cannot add, remove or alter. That means you cannot update those elements here. Why we need, what is the importance means threat safety. So immutable collections can be safely shared among multiple threats. If it is not a threat, say if multiple threats are accessing your object, it will be modified. I don't want to modify. So in that case, okay, I can go for immutable collections. So uh, without even synchronization is also not required. So by default, it will take care. Since collection state is fixed, so there is no risk of a concurrent modification issues here. So that's why immutable collections came to the picture. I will, we have a lot of methods on the list, set and map, copy of method and another for collectors dot unmodifiable list, set and map. I will demonstrate you with one example for list copy of and the collectors modifiable list. So, so that you can practice set and map. If you are facing any problem, I will help you guys. Okay, so let me create a fresh project file new spring starter project let me choose 08 okay uh, here what we can do immutable immutable collections hyphen java 10 okay so let me finish it so quickly create a project com dot java express now right click file new so what i can do all uh, immutable collections a demo okay i will write some method so that it will be easy for you <clears throat> um, now see here guys how to so let me create a list first now where list equal to new array list so now onwards i will use the latest features guys so where keyword i am if you don't know what is ever please go ahead and watch the session so where project also we created optional also we created now let me add a couple of elements here okay even you can create a list let me add suppose 100 okay list dot add of 200 list dot add of 300 okay so we created some elements now in the collections okay uh, have a look here now list dot stream okay uh, let me apply uh, suppose collect you can apply a filter method as well okay here let me take some variable i and if it is a i modulo 2 double equals to 0 i'm applying some condition then I want to collect how to collect see we have a method called inside here to unmodifiable list so that no one can change your result here guys here what is the problem we have I, I mm, there is some issue here why mm. problem here guys we have a list of elements we have a filter method list stream okay no i don't know what happened here okay let me take some different variable temp no some issue here Okay, that's fine. Uh, anyway, that's a different concept. There is some issue there. Um, th that, that's fine. It's a filter method. Now, see here, list.stream.collect. I'm collecting the elements. Now, 
by using this return type you will get as a result now okay the result can be a type of a integer integer here also you can define your integer data type here guys the integer data type here okay that's why filter is not worked here that's okay um, now what we can do if you are trying to add some element 100 suppose i'm adding 1000 i'm adding to this element system dot out dot print ln now so he's even not required here guys let me run this application see here have a look guys unsupported operation exception that means it is a immutable collection you cannot modify at all even you can apply your filter condition i think it not work because of your generic type is not work happen so i modulo 2 double equals to 0 see previously object i not defend so that's why we are faced that issue now see run as java application unsupported operation exception comment it now you can able to print your data result okay 100 to all are even numbers so no issues next another way of creation and what approach copy of see here i want to copy this list to another list see i'm creating a new list here okay you can get the data you can able to display your data no issues here right click run as java application no issues if you are trying to modify this list dot add off suppose 900 okay now again you will get one exception see here unsupported operation exception these are the immutable collections available in the java 10 here guys. okay you can practice a set and map still if you want let us know so we'll create a new video on set and map as well okay thank you guys